Hey, welcome to this video. I always found my living room corner to be a bit too boring. So for this video, I decided to design and build a LED corner lamp. Let's have a look at what I came up with. So I designed the lamp in Fusion 360 and the main element is the vertical light bar, which is a triangular aluminum extrusion. And it also has a diffuser in the front to make the light effect look a bit nicer. On top of that, there is a 3D printed end cap. If you're going down to the base, you can see we also have a 3D printed base element and uh, this comes in multiple variants. For example, this one has spacers to have a nice distance to the corner uh, for a very nice effect. But for example, if you want to move it closer or further away, there's also a variant without a spacer. And there's also a different kind of spacer available. And I also decided to uh, include one version without the hole on top and a second version with a hole on top and the hole would be for a switch. Uh, for example, you could turn it on and off with that switch if you didn't want to use the uh, web interface. The base itself, uh, if you remove the lid, has space for an Arduino, micro or nano and uh, also the button. It also uh, features a hole for the cables to go through, uh, one here in the corner and there are two more holes uh, below or inside the leg pieces or the leg holders and this allows for cables to be routed uh, from for example inside the leg here if you had a sock blocket here you could run a cable through the leg into the base the legs themselves are also aluminium extrusions and those are a square u profile and at the end of those extrusions there are another two 3d printed pieces uh, that hold up the base and uh, keep the legs off the ground to avoid any scratches. So after taking a look at the basic design, I will not be going into the exact details about the build process. Just know that there was a lot of 3D printing, spray painting and soldering involved. If you need to know more information, you can find a link to my website in the description. There you can also find all the CAD files for download. Anyway, let's have a look on how the finished lamp turned out. So during daytime, the lamp is already making the corner a bit more interesting. However, I think the really nice effects only come to play uh, once it's dark outside. So let's make that happen and take another look. So during night, the effect is much better. Currently we're showing all white and we can switch over to a color cycle mode where the whole lamp will cycle through the whole color spectrum very slowly. Both speed and brightness are adjustable and uh, you can also pause at any color you want via the Wi-Fi interface. And thanks to the new Pixel LED strips, different color patterns and animations are possible as well. For example, right now you can see running colors with a fade out at the end, and I programmed several of these animations onto the Arduino. They have options that are adjustable via, via the Wi-Fi interface, and these allow you to modify them. For example, turn on or off the randomization, allow fade outs and all that stuff and uh, i will show off some more of these animations towards the end of the video however i think it's enough of me talking so i want to say thank you very much for watching check out the links in the video description if you're interested in more information and have a great day